Hello friends, welcome back to Jyoti Hydroponics Farm videos. Let's get started to get better at farming. Now we will talk about advantages of hydroponics. Hydroponics uses less nutrient material to feed the plants. These exist within self-contained environment where waste products can be easily controlled. This is much better as it prevents excessive use of fertilizers unlike in the traditional farming where more fertilizers are used and end up flowing into the rivers and spoiling the water to be used by humans and the animals. Now as you can see in the image on the left hand side that these plants are very much capable of taking three nutrients from air itself that is carbon, oxygen and hydrogen and rest fertilizers are being added to the water to prepare the nutrient solution for the plants and these are being added in a controlled environment so that they are not wasted and are fully consumed by the plants only. So this helps to decrease the water pollution and the soil pollution. So the nutrients that we are using for the waters they are nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, copper, boron, calcium, magnesium, chlorine, zinc, sulfate, iron and molybdenum. So we'll talk about these nutrition in later videos. So next switch on to another slide. The next advantage of hydroponics is it utilizes less water and nourishment. In the hydroponic system, less water is used as the required water is supplied in fixed proportions and in a controlled environment. This is very advantageous compared to irrigation or traditional farming methods where much water is wasted and in countries where we have less water supply. This type of hydroponic system can be a success at that place. So hydroponic farming is up to 90% more water efficient than traditional methods. In hydroponics, we never use any kind of soil. So either we use these seven kind of substrate. The first one is rock wool. The second one is oasis cube. Then comes the expanded clay. Then cocoa chips or cocoa fiber or we call it as cocoa peat. Then comes perlite. Then vermiculite and rocks. From all these seven, I suggest only two to be the best. The first one that is rock wool, this one. And the second one is the oasis cube, which is very good option for germination of seeds. And the third option that we use for the substrate for the growth, that is cocoa chips or in a layman term, we call it as cocoa peat. Because rock wool and cocoa peat, they have almost the same water holding capacity. But cocoa peat is much much cheaper than rock wool and is easily decomposable than rock wool. In hydroponics, no soil is needed in the system. Farming is done without any soil and it only uses 10% of the water used on ordinary planting. Furthermore, the plants grown with this method have a higher growth rate compared to normal planting. The faster growth is made possible by a highly controlled environment with the availability of more carbon dioxide, oxygen, water and nourishing substances for the plants. The next advantage of hydroponics is that the production of fruits and veggies can be more in this type of technology in small plots of land. This system requires only a small plot of land since hydroponic produces a faster growth of plants. The areas produced more production per acre plot of land than normal farming. So as you can see in the picture as well, uh, grown, uh, the plants that are grown hydroponically are much bigger with a much increase in production versus the plants grown in soil that are big roots and small plant size with less production. Now in this, hydroponic plants can be produced in any season. There is no limitation of seasonal crops in hydroponic system. 
since they grow in their own control environment which is controlled and protected from outside weather or any insects or animals one of the best advantages of hydroponics is less time and work is required in hydroponics the amount of work needed is very little due to the absence of weeds that would require time to pluck them out this method is time saving since no weeds are present and only a few minutes are needed to check the nutrient levels and the harvesting process it reduces labor dependency by 90% compared to the traditional farming style this means that plants will grow fast depending on their genetics compared to the plants grown in normal soil hydroponic plants grow faster and they appear to be much healthier and happy in the controlled environment when compared to our traditional farming plants the next advantage is hydroponic plants will grow larger this is because you have full control over the plants in optimal environment plants access all the nutrients that they require and in the right proportion hydroponic plants are also said to grow 50% faster this is because the plants do not need to expand their roots to look for nutrients they are already there in the abundance and home hydroponics are said to grow extremely fast we will end this video session here and in the next session we will see the basic requirements we need to set up hydroponic project it will cover land inspection water inspection and weather inspection we'll be looking forward again in the next video till then goodbye and have a nice day thank you